Hi everyone, it's Tara Lynn and welcome back to my YouTube channel, All Yarned Up. And in today's video, I will be doing a huge yarn haul from Joann's. So before I get started with this haul, I want to say most of this haul is Big Twist Value Yarn. Again, all from Joann's. And the yarn was on sale and it was also 25% off your total purchase and free shipping. And... If you don't know, first, hi, my name is Tara Lynn, and I've been crocheting for over 10 years now, and most of my crochet work goes to charity or for gifts for family and friends. So mostly all this yarn will be used for charity work that I do. So let's get started with this haul. So for all the Big Twist value yarn, they were all $1.88 each after the sale and then also with the 25% off. So I will try to go through these as quickly as I can because I have quite a bit of this Big Twist value yarn. And also, I since I've been crocheting for over 10 years now, I really only purchase what I need. So I purchased probably like two big yarn hauls a year. And again, this is mostly all for my charity crochet work. So first I will tell you the specs and again this will be the same for all of these. So this is the Big Twist Value Yarn from Joann's. You get 380 yards. And I, you're, you're supposed to use a USH crochet hook but I usually use a J hook when I make my crochet blankets, crochet projects. Again it's depending what you like, what size hook you like to use and also what you're making but I like to use a J hook most of the time so I purchased two of these and this color is in sky blue so next I have this purple and this is in lilac I have two in pale yellow Two in mint. One in this Nile green, and I believe this is a new green color. Two in this blue. That color blue, I'm not sure how to say it. Two in Diva Pink, and I believe this also is a new color in the Big Twist value. Two in this, I think that's Scion, like a turquoise blue. Two in Medium Rose. Two in the colorway Slime. I love this color. It's a really cool color. And one in this colorway Soft Gray. Two in Varsity Yellow. Two in Safety Yellow. And I believe this is also a new colorway. And this is really bright. Two in the colorway mushroom. Two in hot pink. Two in sage green. Two in Cosmetic Pink. Two in Coral. Two skeins in Magenta. Two in Cornflower Blue. Two in Watermelon. 
one skein in orange, two in soft purple, two in cream, two in orchid, two in aqua, Two in medium gray, two in denim blue, two in eggplant, two in camel, two in varsity red. Two in dark teal. Two skeins in fig, just like a dark purple color. Two in grape. And two in, I believe this is purple, the tags fell off of these. One skein in teal. Two skeins in dark coral. One skein in varsity green. Two skeins in plum. One skein in light green. Two skeins in forest green, two skeins in varsity navy blue, two skeins in varsity blue, two skeins in deep red, and two skeins in burgundy. So that's all for the Big Twist of Value yarn. So next part of this haul, I purchased some variegated uh, Joann's brand, Karen, one pound, and Red Heart Super Saver, and also some Lion brand baby yarn. So I will be going through this now. So first I purchased three skeins of Big Twist Value yarn, and this is in the colorway roller rink. And I believe this is a new colorway very beautiful so I wanted to try out this colorway they had some other new colorways but they were all out of, out of them so I picked this one I'm not sure what I'll be making but I really wanted to try out some of these variegated yarns so here's the first one that I picked and I'm again I'm not sure on the price of these yarns again they were all on sale and then an, an additional 25% off. So I did get good deals on all of these, uh, the whole yarn haul. So next I tried out this Big Twist Value in the ombre colors and I purchased one, they have six colorways and I purchased one of each and probably just gonna make beanies to try these out and see how they work up. So this one is in gray ombre this is sunrise ombre pink ombre and this is the gray one really quick has some white and black in it too Next, I purchased the purple ombre. The aqua ombre. And the blue ombre. So again, I just wanted to try these out. I will probably try them out by making beanies and I'll make a video and show you after I try them out.
so next this red heart super saver saver jumbo speckle yarn and this is in bubble gum speckle this is a fairly new yarn but i haven't tried it out yet so i just purchased one skein to try this out and again i'm not sure what i'll be making if you have any ideas for me leave them please leave them in the comments below and i'll see what i can come up with to make with these so again this is in bubblegum speckle in red heart super saver next red heart super saver ombre this is in sweet treat this one has been out for quite a while now but i haven't tried this colorway yet so i really wanted to try this out this is purples blues so i thought this was really pretty next i believe this one is new red heart super saver bitty stripes and this is in mermaid So, uh, again, I thought I'd try this out. And again, just one skein to try out. Okay, these next two are Karen Jumbo, and this is Karen Jumbo Ombre. And this is in Seashell. And I think this one's been out for a while, but again, I haven't tried it yet. This is like tans and purples. And they have quite a few colorways in this. The ombre colors. But I thought this one was... They're all really pretty, but... I really love purple. So I thought I would try this one. And here's another Karen Jumbo. This one's been out for a long time now. But it was on sale, so I thought I would... Get it just to play around with and make something. So this colorway is Russian Sage. Purple and aquas, dark teal. So here's that yarn. So last I purchased this Lion Brand ice cream yarn, a uh, three pack. And this is baby three weight yarn in the colorway butter pecan so tan gray and blue and white and making a baby blanket for my neighbor's first well second grandbaby but first grandson so this will be for a baby blanket so that's the end of my joanne's yarn haul Again, most of this yarn will be used for my crochet charity work and also gifts for family and friends. So please subscribe so you can watch my future videos and see what I make with all of this new yarn that I purchased. So also I'm going to put all this new yarn away now in my cubbies that I have, my yarn storage. So I will add a clip after I put this all away of my organization for my yarn that I use. So stay tuned for that at the end of this video. Okay, so here's a quick view of my yarn storage. And this 12 cube storage I purchased from Amazon last year and I will have it linked below. So again, it's 12 cubes and this is all of my solid yarns. So this is my yarn wall and where I keep my yarn stored. So besides this yarn storage, the 12 cube storage that I just showed you, I just have this one other tote bin for storage for yarn. And this is just a regular size bin. I probably purchase this from like Big Lots. And you can also purchase these containers from like Target, Walmart, any place like that and this has just some extra solid yarns and all my variegated are in the rest the rest of the yarns in this container and then I have 
a lot of these mini yarns from three kits. Two kits were gifted to me of these and one I purchased from Amazon. So I have quite a bit of these mini skeins of Red Heart Super Saver. So they're in there as well. So this is all of my yarn in what's in these 12 cubes and then what's in this container. I don't like to keep a whole lot of extra yarn. I like to keep it out so I know what I have. So that is my yarn storage. Again, I purchased this 12 cube system from Amazon and it was very easy to put together. So that's how I store my yarn. And again, I will have this 12 cube system from Amazon linked below. I also wanted to add in this video about my yarn collection. As you could tell from my yarn stash, I have all 100% worsted weight, four weight acrylic yarn. Since I donate mostly all of my crochet work to charity, I really only work with 100% acrylic yarn. I do like bulky yarn and baby yarn from time to time, but, and also cotton. Um, not so much wool because I'm allergic to wool and I usually break out when I use it. So since I donate, again, mostly all of my work to charity, I like to use 100% worsted four weight acrylic yarn. So that's why that's all I have in my yarn stash. So I just wanted to say that. I have used, again, like bulky yarn and baby yarn over the years. Again, I've been crocheting over 10 years, but I really don't tend to use them a lot. So I just purchase them when I'm going to use them. And really that's not all that often. Right now I do have some baby yarn. I am currently making a baby blanket for my neighbor's first grandson. So since I needed that, I purchased it special for that gift. So again, I really don't keep those other yarns on hand. So I just wanted to add that to this video. So that's all for this clip. So again, here's my current yarn stash.